What's going on guys, man, it's your boy Tay Young. And today we're gonna be installing a new six by nines on my front door panels, uh, front passenger and passenger, front passenger and driver, my bad. My speakers have been blown out for a while, probably like a couple months now, and it really sounds terrible. So, I don't know, I just randomly popped up in the store and said, hey, I'm gonna grab these kickers over here. Uh, they sounded okay. They're way better than what I have now. Busted. But, uh, the system that's in here now is the Infinity Audio System, which it didn't sound too bad um, when it was fixed. It really sounded pretty good. We're not replacing them with Infinity right now. Uh, that probably costs a little more, too. So I'm just we're gonna try out these kickers and see how it goes. Um, yeah, so stay tuned. All right, so first step, we're gonna be removing this screw behind the handle. It's like a, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it's literally right in there where my finger is. It's like a number, it's a T40 size, I believe. You can kind of see it right there, there it is. Removing this one here at the top. And then there's two at the bottom, this one and this one. And that should pop the door handle, the door panel off. So, I'll get to, straight to that. Really hoping that when I get behind this door panel, that the uh, speaker disconnection and connection is not as difficult as it always is once you get behind another door. So, fingers crossed. Maybe this one right here is supposed to come off too. Okay. Yep, that one's supposed to come up too. And you pull it up. And off she goes. Then there is uh, two control uh, switches you want to disconnect the, the door panel. You know, for the window and stuff like that in the mirror. You want to disconnect those and the door should be free. Alright, what do you have here behind the door? You have the speaker. The 6x9. Now... Let's see how this is going to go. Okay. There's a little switch here that popped right out of this one. And that was pretty simple. So, let's just pray that the kickers are the same way. Incompatible. Okay, I can tell right now that they're a little different. Uh, how different? Not sure. It's kind of the same though. They just don't have this box here. Oh shit, that's like a magnetic thing. I hope I didn't fuck nothing up. I just felt it like kind of pulling close to each other. So this piece is not on here. This gray box is not on the new speakers. Yeah, this thing is, has a magnet on it. It's like 
catching everything. But we do have this uh, adapter piece here, so hopefully this um, this helps with a lot. Hallelujah. So guys, this adapter piece here is a lifesaver. This connects to this old piece here where the, the old one came off of and this end will go into the speakers. So I think, I think we might be good. I just gotta figure out which one goes into what. Okay. And clipping in now. And she is in. Let's see if it fits better this way. Oh shit. We're gonna try to center up this thing as best as possible. So, of course, I don't have the uh, this piece on, but we'll throw that on. I just want to make sure that it actually works. So we're gonna turn the car on and see if it comes on. Oh yeah, we got action, guys. All right guys, so they do come on. I'm gonna do the other side and then uh, we're gonna do a sound test and see how it works. So that was really simple. It was like literally probably like five steps or something like that. You guys know you count it, probably count it. But um, it's in. All we have to do is put the door panel back on, put these back on, screws, and do the other side. And uh, that was easy peasy. Just hope this, uh, this piece here fits without any problems. Shouldn't have any problems. Uh, yeah, I'm excited. Won't be uh, listening to that staticky sound anymore. And sorry guys, it took a while for a new upload, but got a lot going on. And if you guys like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, maybe you guys see me real soon. All right, guys, I got both sides on in the truck. I only did the front, uh, the driver and the passenger front side, so. Don't know if I need to make some adjustments somewhere else, like the, uh, the dash or the back speakers. So, waiting on, oh, here we go, tester. Your beauty marks and blemishes. Very poison, 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 poison. For the good kind. Not bad, y'all. It's not bad. You feel me? It definitely sounds a lot better than what it was. I wish I could could hear how terrible it sounded in here, but I'm sure you all have heard busted speakers before. But so that's how you install two uh, six by nines in a 2008 Dodge Ram. And if you guys have any questions, uh, just hit me in the comments and uh, or find me on IG. And uh, again, I'll see y'all in the next video. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, and I appreciate y'all. Yeah.